Listen, I got a message for you. I know it's just for you. I want you to receive this, okay? If you hear this and you receive it, it's going to bless you real good. Listen, stop letting people waste time and space in your life, all right? You got to cut that off, all right? Stop letting the wrong people waste your time and waste your space. You know what happens when you let people waste your time? What am I talking about? I'm talking about people that's phony, that's fake, all right? They talk to you and y'all having these long conversations and it's just a bunch of gibberish. It's just a bunch of foolishness. You know, they just want to converse with you and talk to you. People that's trying to stay close to you because they can see where you're going. They really don't like you, but they like your future because the enemy can see your future. And when the enemy can see your future, they want to benefit from you. So they'll act like they're your friend. They'll act like they love you just to stay close to you, just in case you blow up, just in case something changes. They want to appear to be that they've always been your friend. Stop letting people waste your time and waste your space. Most of them folks aren't talking about anything. They always talk about what they're about to do, what they're getting ready to do. And then when you do what you do, they don't even support you. But when you come out with your results, they want to attach themselves to your results and attach themselves to your vision. And they haven't put in any work with you. They haven't even prayed for you. In fact, they gossip about you and talk about you, but yet they're wasting your time trying to act like they're your friend. You got to ask God to cut on that switch of discernment in your life so that you can pick these people out, mark them, and dismiss them. They're wasting your time. They're wasting your space. Some of us got people in our life that's fake and phony. They, they ain't real at all. Just acting so that they can stay close. And what happens is they take up valuable space in your life when God is trying to send good people, real people, folks that are really going to bless your life. They can't even connect with you because you got the wrong people taking up space. All right, hear me. Listen, everybody's not so bad, but everybody's not supposed to be connected with you. And where you're going, listen to me, there are going to be people that are supposed to be in your life for the rest of your life. Then there are people that are going to be in your life for a season. Then there's some people that aren't supposed to be in your life at all. Now, we know how to dismiss them, recognize them real quick, get them on out the way. But where the enemy tricks us and where the enemy fools us is by the people that are supposed to be in our life for a season. They're supposed to come, do what they're supposed to do. You're supposed to do what you're supposed to do to bless them and they bless you for that season. And what we end up doing, we think that because somebody did something good for us one time, they're supposed to be connected to us for the rest of our life. When it is a fact that you're being stymied, you're being slowed down, watch this here, because those seasonal people are blocking your blessing because they're still in your life, but their season is up. You got to be quick to dismiss and say, listen, hey, I got to move on. I'm not mad at you. I don't hate you. I just learned to recognize that our season is up. So we got to stop all this fake laughing. I got to stop coming around you and acting like I'm glad to be around you. You got to stop acting like you love me and you have to. Don't text me. Don't email me. Don't send me no fake message just to keep in touch so that, you know, you can be attached to the blessing. You got to make up in your mind. If you're going to be blessed the rest of this year and get where God is taking you, stop wasting your time with those type of people. Stop allowing negative people, fake and phony people, all right? I like to call them plastic people because they're fake. Stop letting those people waste your time and waste your space. God is taking you to greater places, but he's not going to release you to go until you learn how to let go of some folk that you ain't supposed to be carrying anymore. I love you guys. I want you to receive this word. Share this video on your page and share it with your friends so that somebody else can be blessed right now. And remember, every day of your life is a day of victory.